Praise the Lord, saints, and welcome back to FFT, Food for Thought Ministries, where we move with purpose in our walk with Christ over here. My name is Rokisha Muhammad, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you've been with me since day one, welcome back, family. All right, I am back with another Bible review. And the Bible that I will be reviewing and unboxing is the Spiral Bible, okay? The Spiral Bible. I've been seeing this all over Facebook and Instagram. Um, I happen to um, also see this on the Word Nerd um, YouTube channel. Go over there and check her out. She also has a review on this, the Word Nerd. Go and check her out. So let's open up this baby. This is again the Spiral Bible. Okay, let's see. The Spiral Bible. Okay, this is what it's looking like. Still in the plastic. I did get the New Testament. It is in the King James Version. Okay, so let me try to take this plastic off, y'all. Okay. Spiral Bible. This is becoming, it looks like it's becoming very popular in the journaling community. So if you are a journaler or a note taker, you might enjoy this. Okay. So here it is. Okay. I feel like a regular notebook, right? It's a notebook size. I believe it's like uh, eight and a half by 11 or nine and a half by 11. Just like a regular notebook size okay so this is the print that i got it is called the spiral bible this is the new testament in the king james version and it says here the word of god for note takers okay so here is the spine on what it looks like with these plastic um what is these rings okay just a regular card hard cardboard backing so it's just like a notebook so let's open it up see what it do this print is very pretty pick this all right here we go it says the new testament the king james version property of so i guess this would be the um presentation page just like regular paper <laughs> okay over here is the copyright 2022 by spiral bible the king james version all right you see all that good stuff and here is and then it just goes into um what is this the word of god for note takers a little explanation taking notes helps you get more out of god's word it's time to start writing in your bible okay Let's just read that because a lot of people still don't really like to write in their Bible. I don't understand why. Hold on one second. All right, so it says, let's just read all of it. Let's just let's just read it. Okay, let's just read it because that's what I do. So here, and it's laying completely flat from page one is flat okay because of the rings and you can flip it over but let's read this here it says the word of god for note takers it says the bible is a collection of ancient writings and letters about god and his son jesus throughout the centuries people have looked to the bible as a source of knowledge and inspiration until about 100 years ago most people did not have access to a personal bible or the ability to study it on their own. Today, there are over more than 80,000 versions with hundreds of millions in print. And of course, the Bible is accessible online and even on our phones. Even so, few people spend time studying their Bible. That's why we were created the Spiral Bible. Okay, so that's their reason for their creating it. Then here it says note taking. I mean, 
taking note helps you get more out of God's word. It says God words, God word is meant to be interacted and engaged with, not just passively read. Otherwise, it becomes just like any other book, not a life-giving light in the darkness. We published the Spiral Bible, a lay-flat Bible you can mark up so you can immerse yourself in the Word. It's a Bible for note-takers, and we hope you use it to dig deeper into God's messages for your life. In our prayer, we in our prayers, we talk to God, and our Bible study God talks to us. It's time for you to let God talk to you through his word. Love that. Love that. And then the second paragraph says, for some of us, marking the pages of a Bible is intimidating. I know somebody. <laughs> it says, we don't want to clutter up our, or disturb God's word. And if we're honest, we wonder if it's even allowed. Since the Bible is often printed on fancy rice thin paper that is difficult to write on, we refrain from sc scrolling our thoughts on it on its pages is this you no <laughs> no it's not i write in my bible okay it says when you start to read the bible the plan i mean the when you start to write the bible with a pen and marker in hand you encounter god in a new and refreshing ways it will improve your focus concentration and help you to organize your thoughts as the word unfolds before your eyes you can make spiral you can make spiral markers i mean you can make spiritual markers of your journey through god's word and cover the pages in notes prayers, reminders, and even drawings, whatever method you choose, you'll begin an ongoing conversation with the Lord, speaking back to him as you read verse and passages. Let the spiral Bible become your spiritual scrapbook. And it says here, join others who are using their spiral bible at www.spiralbible.com together we can compare notes and share what we've learned we hope you see you there all right so spiral bible okay here is um, a little note page here so let's turn into it boom we are into the book of matthew just straight up with our notes on the side, just like a journaling, but it's notebook size, so it's really big enough, right? Oh, y'all can't even see. So here it is. We have, because this is New Testament, so we're starting with Matthew 1, and it's going from 1 through 21. We have over here the Gospel of Matthew, and then here's where you can take your notes. You can even write a date right here when you started taking these notes, or even write here in this section, whatever you want to do. You can write prayers here. You can write specific notes. Um, you can do drawings. Like I said, you can be creative and do what you want to do, but it is a note-taking spiral Bible. And look at over here, you guys, this whole page of free hand not freehand, but just a single full page of blank lines where you can take notes or create art. All right, look at that. Look at that. A full page of notes that you can take here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so let's see. So it is a single column, as you can see. It is just a single column. And this looks like about... Maybe, let me see, do I have more? It's probably like three inches maybe of note-taking space. The font is a 10-point font, okay? The um, chapter um, headings right here are huge and bold. As you can see, this is chapter two. Look over here, you cannot miss it. Chapter three, where it begins. I do not see any subtitle headings so far. But we do have chapter headings to let you know where you are, what you're reading. Um, the notes section, again, does show that you are in the Gospel of Matthew. Okay? So let's just turn the page here. You still even have extra space here for when this stopped. 
and you get a full page not you don't get a full page on every single ending of chapter but most of them you will have a full page of blank note taking space okay and you can fold this like this so it can just be flat where you can do your art and it'll take up a lot of your table space all right so that is an advantage with it being spiral kind of like the illustrated bible is okay that's what it kind of reminds me of and um yeah this is pretty much the layout y'all it's pretty basic um if you're if you're scared to write in your actual bible you can get one of these where the paper is like it's a little thicker than it's like it's thick okay it's not like flimsy regular paper that you just print put in your printer and print it's a nice thick paper it doesn't look like it'll do a lot of bleed through but um let's just test it and see let's just let's just see okay what is do let me find something let me go to john one and one because i will definitely want to highlight that so let's go there okay here we go john one and one this is just a test of the highlighter okay just to see if it's gonna bleed through and this is a what is this a big bright liner grip pastel so let's just see all right there it is Ooh, no bleed through and nothing look at that nothing on the other side nothing on the other side that's so thick and here it is okay and there's no bleed through let me try another one okay let's try um here is a sharpie okay this is just these ain't bible pens these are just regular highlighters too okay so let me just see what it do i would have highlighted that anyway so there it is and let's turn the page there it is y'all can y'all see little shadow very very little shadowing but it is a go it's a go for me it's a go for me it's it, yeah baby yes yes so you you can use the regular crayon ones if you want to or the gel highlighters that don't bleed through but it don't look like you can use a regular highlighter and you're going to be fine you're going to be fine okay you're going to be fine so well let me just see something here um let me just put a date here what's today today is 10 16 22 and this is with a paper mate ink joy Okay, let's see if it bleeds through. Little shadowing, but no bleed through. Okay, shadowing, but no bleed through. Now it's with an ink joy. So, just so you have an idea. All right, so yeah, y'all, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to get on here and share this. Um, it's huge. Well, it's not huge, huge, but it's the size of a regular notebook. And let me see, it is a little over um it is 300 and 97 pages it goes all the way through revelations okay and at the end you just get some couple of note notebook pages blank pages at the end of revelations one two and then you're at the end so again you can roll this over you can have it sorry y'all you can just have it like a regular notebook open up like this depending on what side you want to work or flip it use this side flip it over and use this side and still have plenty of space to have your everything laid out and it doesn't take up a lot of desk space so here it is the spiral bible check them out i will leave the link in the description box right now they do have a 20 percent sale going on so whenever depends on when you watch this video i'm not sure if that coupon code will still be active but just check out the website um so they're yeah just check out the website because they'll probably be having all kind of sales going on but right now there is a 20 percent discount on the spiral bibles and they also have the old testament in the first five books which is the law from 
um, Genesis through Deuteronomy. They also have um, um, poetry, which is going to be from Job through Solomon, Songs of Solomon. Um, they do have covers for men, women. They also have spiral Bibles for children. So go ahead over there and check it out if you're scared to writing your Bible and you want something like this to be your test run, you know, till you get used to writing in your Bible. If you don't own a journaling Bible, but you want to, you don't know if you're going to like it or not, go ahead and check this out. Spiral Bible. Okay. So yeah, I just wanted to jump on here really quickly to let you guys know about this. Um, so yeah, this is the cover that I got in the New Testament and it is um, in the King James Version, and I believe there's um, they're coming out with other translations as well. But right now, I think it's King James in the A American Version Standard or something like AVS or something like that. So I know that they only have it in two translations right now. I'm not sure if they're going to get it in any other translations. But for right now, I just see KJV. So that might be a problem for some of you all, unless you just use this as your you know you know studying in here and then have another translation that you really like to read and then just come in here and mark so it's all up to you there's so many ways you can use this so again i'm out just want to come on here and share um check out the link in the description box this is not a sponsored video i'm just sharing and i like to support ministries okay so i just wanted to just grab this up um yeah so here it is y'all the Bible, I mean the Spiral Bible in the New Testament KJV version. Have a good one. Bye-bye now.